All these little bits of pieces of plastic, and there are over 100,000 of them in this particular work, are all caps and stoppers and tops and connectors for all the equipment that we use and the medications that we give. What well, how it started was simply I was using these things and, and I'd be as everyone else does, just throw them out. I'd use it for whatever purpose, to give an injection or to attach it to an IV or to connect a feeding tube. And then I thought, well, gee, they're, they're so cute, they're pretty. They remind me of so much, so many moments I've had with patients. So I started to just put them in my pocket rather than throw them out. They're perfectly clean. I would just put them in my pocket, and bags and bags of this stuff, and I would just kind of store it away, never knowing really what I was going to do with it. I came to a time of about a year and a half ago when I realized I was going to leave the ICU. I have a very good friend, she's an artist, and she came up with the idea of the board, and then we sort of started randomly here, actually. And that's the top from the adrenaline that we use during a cardiac arrest. This orange cap is the top of a blood culture bottle. The little purple tails are the tops of the lancets that we use to test blood sugar. You've got a hand down here with the veins going through it. And you've got a face, and these are meant to be words coming out. These are caps from a, a medication that we give to avoid um, rejection when a patient's had a transplant. If I look at some of this material that was involved in treating patients with liver transplants, I remember many of them. And I remember most of the individuals I cared for who underwent lung transplants always very sick and so many of them did so well so many and of course I remember always the ones that the few that didn't they always will stay with me and are memorialized here at least in my mind and hopefully in other people's but uh, I treasure those memories of all the patients I've cared for and I'm looking back on my career for 828 years but I hope young nurses and young doctors see this and hopefully it makes them remember that all these little things we do are huge for the patient we do it hundreds of times a day and night and for all these years, but each thing that we did with each little piece of plastic meant so much to the patient. And that's really what this mural represents. One thing by itself is meaningless, but it's all of it together is what makes it possible to do the work that we do, and it's so easy to forget that. And I hope this mural is a moment of mindfulness. You do nursing for this long, and medicine, you use these things, and they, to me, represent all of that work and all of that care that I gave.